Hello guys, welcome back to another video. This video is gonna be a little different from the videos that I normally do, but I'm gonna be starting a new series called Fishing Hawaii 101. And basically it's gonna be a series where I teach viewers like you how to fish and some of my methods and tricks on how I fish in Hawaii. So we're gonna start from the beginning and I'm gonna show you two main knots that I use when I go fishing. So the first knot is called the clinch knot. It's pretty common and pretty easy to tie. Now this knot serves multiple purposes. So it could tie hook, could tie leads, tie floaters, three-way swivels, two-way swivels, basically everything. Now I'm gonna show you how to tie it. Right? All right, so now I'm gonna teach you how to do it. So you get your hook or whatever you're gonna tie, put it through, or hook you go from the bottom. Pull it out just like that. And now you're gonna wrap it four to eight times, depending on how thick your line is. The thicker it is, the less wraps you do. So I'm gonna do around that much wraps. Then I take this end put it straight through that loop right there. So now it looks like that. Then I'm gonna go back through this loop. So it looks like that. Then I'm just gonna clinch it. You may need to lubricate it if it doesn't slide. Just like that. And that is how you tie your clinch knot. Strong knot, use it a lot for whipping, but usually for the hooks, I use a different knot. So what I showed you was the clinch knot, multiple purposes, tie floaters, leads, swivels, and hooks with it. But this knot is called the snail knot. This knot is only for hooks. It's a little more difficult to tie, but I always use this knot. So what you wanna do is you get your line and you wanna go through the hook like this from the front of the hook. Okay. Then you wanna go down the hook like this. Pull some line out. Make down the hook like that. Hold the corner of the hook so it's like that, okay? Like this and you wrap it around the hook and the line. I usually do around five to six wraps, whatever your lucky number is. Okay, just like that. Then you get your other hand, hold it down like this. And see that loop right there? Line. Go back inside. Hold the bottom. And just pull. And that is the snail knot. And what you want to do? Clip off the end. Always. There it is. I prefer this knot over the clinch knot, but this knot is only for hooks. And there you have it, the two main knots that I use for fishing. There's many other knots out there. Maybe they're faster to tie, or maybe they're stronger, I'm not sure. But these work just fine. These are really popular and somewhat easy to tie. Um, I hope you guys learned something today, and I'll see you in the next Fishing Hoi 101 episode. Thanks for watching. Mahalo.